J Bills for me to spotlight UK reunited with Salt Pappy in the building. I'm good. Nice to see you again. Always good to see you, brother. I mean, look, made it. I made it. <laughs> we all made it. We all made it here. Um, I mean, what happened in there earlier? I was seeing what was going on. Uh, you were telling me earlier that you were just trying to get in, and what, what happened? I was trying to do like you know, just stay calm, like do my thing. And this guy, like you know, came out of nowhere, just started talking. What 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 was being said? I wasn't even ready. I was like, you know, I'm just gonna come here, like, and do my thing, like, you know, do a little bit of shadow boxing. This guy just talking, like, you know, just random, like, random shit out of nowhere. Like, mm. yeah, obviously, I had to, like, you know, defend myself. Yeah, of course. And um, yeah, I just told him to shush, like, you know. Yeah, I saw that, and I was thinking, like, I, I I thought there might have been scrappage already, but luckily, it hasn't happened yet. It was like, um, I've experienced a lot of, like, you know, I've dealt with a lot of people like this sure. in my like a previous career. I was a nurse. So I deal with lala. Yeah, so yeah. it's like normal for me to like you know. So you just came in and obviously, yeah. you know, it seemed he put it on you straight away. But you were just like, okay, cool. I was like, I need to warm up. I need to warm up first because I came in. I was like a little bit shy at first. Yeah. But then as the time goes, I become like confident. Because we've seen like the videos that have been put from Ferrari, um, you know, towards you. We saw like the Misfits video yeah. where you were reacting to him, you know, you know. <laughs> letting you know that he's coming for you um you know what do you what did you make of all of that and obviously you seeing him in the ring now like you know how 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 do you take him so far as what you've seen i mean he's trying to like um like bully trying to intimidate me but it's not working really like um it reminds me of those bully back in school that i beat up really and wow like <laughs> he just beat them up and then they become nice to me at the yeah. end yeah i remember yeah i had he's, he's like one of those like um so basically, he looks like, uh, reminds me of Andy Worski, but like, like maybe like final boss. Wow. Wow. Because I mean, I, I, was, I was speaking to him earlier and, you know, he was mentioning that, you know, obviously with the fights that you've had, um, him being in an MMA background that he's in, you know, um, he, he doesn't see you as much. Let's be, let's be honest. He doesn't see yeah, you as much. So like, how do you react to that? That's like an excuse, really. He'll always talk about like street fight, street fight, but this is boxing. Mm. This is not street fight, homie. So... Like, oh, like oh, I'm gonna beat you up in street, like in you know, a street fight. Like, it is boxing. Like, you know what you're talking about? Yeah. Cause, I mean, even in there as well. Like, you know, he he was he was he was shouting at you. He was shouting at your coach Solomon as well. I mean, you know, it seemed like you guys were just on chilled and whatever. But he was shouting. So, I mean, how do you make of all that? I mean, we're building to your fight for Saturday anyway. It's just um, really stressing himself, like you know, for no reason. Like me, I'm just, I'm gonna stay calm, save my energy for Saturday night and let him like, you know, stress himself. I saw your uh, video that just came out, uh, was it yesterday, uh, with your final parts of training. And obviously Tempo, uh, he's, he's, he came in to do some things with you as well. Like, so how has been the last preparations in, you know, the last like bit of camp to get you ready? Like, cause you've been used to this now at this point. Yeah, I'm, I'm quite used to it. Like, you know, I train really hard for this fight, like always. Um, I didn't have to lose weight for this fight. I gained weight for this fight. Oh, you gained weight? Yeah, I gained weight. So I gained like 4 kg of okay. muscle. So How comfortable do you feel like, uh, at this weight? Very comfortable. I feel right. strong. Um, I feel more energetic. And um, yeah, no way this guy can beat me at this, like, at this weight. Do you feel like obviously now that you're in a main event, um, is there any pressure to deliver? Because obviously I know you've come up come off a few losses with uh, Slim and Anthony Taylor. Yeah. Do you feel more, do you feel any pressure because you feel that obviously main event, you want to make a mark and you want to build yourself up further as a fighter. Do you feel any pressure or does it, does it not bother you? It doesn't really bother me. There's no pressure for me. I'm going to do what I do best and uh, hopefully get the W on Saturday. Uh, final few things from me. Um, of course, obviously Kenny is facing Adam Brooks. Um, uh, that, a lot of people have been saying that should you win your fight and should Kenny win his fight, that down the road it could be you two to be facing each other. Is that something that appeals to you? I know you're focused uh, of Ferrari for now, but is that something that you would entertain down the line? Anybody can get it. You already know the I already knew the answer to that. Yes, sir. So. Well, so always a pleasure to see you. I know there's going to be a lot of like craziness throughout the week. Yeah, this is actually my first time, like you know, dealing with like like in a like an um, event like yeah. this where someone's talking shit to me so I have to like, you know, you don't really, um, like not much people see like how I am, how I deal with it. So maybe this is like the first. Well, it'll be interesting to see because obviously I know you were the cool dynamic. Yeah, He's sometimes, uh, sometimes I probably do lose, lose my cool and I probably 
Talk Rarely do I ever see you lose your cool back. Though. Yeah, and yeah, sometimes I don't I do I do talk shit back. Yeah. <laughs> well, we'll see how I'm working <laughs> on it. I'm working on it. Oh like like, like kind of a motherfucker. <laughs> I like, you're a motherfucker. Yeah, this motherfucker. Yeah. I mean, yeah, well, I mean, it's going to be crazy throughout the week. I mean, you know, what do you want to say to your fans out there? Um, you know, what final words for the fans out there? Yeah, I just want to thank you. I uh, thank all the my supporters and everyone watching and supporting me throughout the way. And um, to Ferrari, just wish him all the best, really. Yeah. And you couldn't, got, couldn't get no clearer than that. Salt Papi, I wish you all the best. I'll see you throughout the week anyway. And I know things are going to be popping off. Always you a pleasure. Know, all, you know, all my fights are entertaining, so you need to tune in, yeah. Everybody tune in.